Where's your date? Let me see if I can get it right. Now. Okay, we're recording. Okay. Ken is yeah. riding number 15 with this really cool little uh, trailer setup. So Ken, how's your cannonball been going? It's been going great and uh, I've learned a lot. This, um, the, the things you think you know until you get out and actually do it, then everything starts making more sense. So are you going to do this again? Yes, but definitely with a different bike. Okay, why would you not ride your Vespa GTS 250? Uh, that's a 300. Okay, Je uh, what year is it? It's a 2014. So, what would you change about the 2014 GTS for the next Cannonball? Well, I'm going to go with like a GT200. I'm going to find one and uh, work on that and let that be the bike because it has a better handicap. So, you think it has, you'll outperform your uh, 250 or 300? I think so. I think I could. And what do you, why do you think that you would do better with the 200 than the uh, 300? Because I know you've done some custom build on this, so are you playing anything special with the 2020 for 2025 with the GT200? I would probably really do some work on the suspension, maybe, uh, um, you know, help the engine out a little bit. But, uh, well, you know, if you modify the engine, it's going to uh, decrease your handicap. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I think you could you could do like a head. I think they're talking about like a cylinder or something. Well, if you do a cylinder yeah. kit, you're going to lower, uh, increase your handicap. That's right, that's right. So but you think that'd be a like good trade-off? Yeah, I think I would do like a, maybe a, just a, a head, not a uh, not the cylinder. Okay. Yeah. Well, you are doing pretty well in this cannonball. I know I've passed you a few times and you've passed me some. Yeah. You have a better handicap than I do since I'm running the 2023. So I suspect you're ahead of me on the uh, status. So good luck for the rest of the cannonball because I you. know you've had no real issues. Thank you.